Hello everybody, I'm the Fish and FKS and welcome back to another episode of Fire Emblem. In the last episode we defeated chapter 2 and we got the Manichetti and today's episode we'll be continuing chapter 3. The secrets of a past revealed in the two words of two knights of Lysia. Now to meet her grandfather Lynn heads west to Lysia and to her destiny. A mountain range upwards to, S to Sakai Place from Burr. There are many bandits lurking here. The crews as rich are they tell of her. They wreak havoc on both Sakai and on Burr, and this their savagery knows no bounds. On the tenth day away from the plains, L L Lynn witnesses their atrocities herself. Chapter 3 Band of Mercenaries This place, it's... The entire area is in wounds. Why doesn't the Marquess do anything to help? Telephone Mountain is home to a gang of vicious, ruthless bandits. No Marquess holds her power here. My village was near here, on the other side of the mountain. My people were. The telephone bandits came at night. It took only one night. The survivors numbered less than ten, including me. The soulless beasts. I will never forgive them. Never! Lindus. I'm not running away. I will be back someday. I'll be stronger. I will break the swords beneath me, like twigs beneath a stallion hooves! I will avenge my people, I will do everything in my power. When the time comes, bring me with you. Same. Do not forget me either. Can't. Oh, you too, Vision? Yes, we're going to fight them, we're going to beat them, we're going to break their legs! I, you thank you. Wait right there, you little lady. What are you going to do, Paul Jones? Huh? I... that is... I... Hey, she's going to catch you, buddy. I bet the boss uh, give you a pretty penny for her. Yeah, she roughed me up a bit, so I figure fair is fair. It's no more than she deserves. I... I... What are we going to do with her flying mule? Don't you dare to touch her! What? You with your gum, you mad girly! Do what you will and me, just... Let her go, please, I beg of you! Ha ha ha, silly twit. Because it will be found in alien. The rare beast with more than you by fall. Can sell it for more, for a mob of gold. Let it go? Ha. No, you can't. Come on, let's move. What's this? Beyond the gold, Linus. There seems to be some sort of commotion over there. That's that's a Pegasus, could it be? Florina! Is that you, Florina? Ah, oh, Lynn. Florina! What are you doing in a place such as this? Lynn! Is it really you? I... Come now, no crying. I'm sorry. Your acquaintances? She's my friend. This is Florina, a Pegasus Knight in training for Melia. She's a little uncomfortable around men. Tell me, Florina. What happened here? Well, um, when I heard that you had left, I decided to follow you. Then I saw this village. I flew down to ask if they had news for you. I didn't see these two end well. Did your Pegasus land on them? Well, uh, a little. 
Are you heard her? She admits her fault. She stepped on my front, and now she's gotta pay. Did you apologize for Rina? Yes. I told him I was sorry many times over. They wouldn't listen. Don't cry, it's alright. Lynn. Listen, she obviously said sorry. Can't we just let this pass? You don't appear to be injured or anything? No chance. The girl goes with us by force if need be. Hey, come on out, boys. The men are fair game, but don't put a scratch on the girls. Vision, we gotta fight back. Lynn, I. You're a Pegasus Knight, aren't you? You can fight, can't you? Yes. Listen carefully, Vision, we're facing bandits. They're underlings, but we can take them too slightly. Let's clear them out of the way, are you ready? The layout around here might make it difficult to fight. The, the same holds true for all of you, too. If you use these walls so, just so, they may ensure our victory. Lynn, who's that? This is Vision, he's still an apprentice, but he's my tactician. Oh, I see. Uh, Vision, uh, I'm pleased to meet you. The red proof buildings are villages. Villages are in danger of being attacked. If an enemy unit reaches a village before one of your units does, the village will be destroyed. As quickly as possible, the visit, vi visit, the, uh, visit the residents and give them warning. Only good can come with it. So let's visit them. Yes, was basically what I said uh, last episode. If you see a v building with a red roof, it's important. If you see a uh, building with a brown roof, you can skip it. But um, Basically what it is now is that you have to visit this uh, village, it's mandatory. Is anyone there? Leave us alone, you dogs! Go away! Go away! We got no more gold for you! No, wait, please, we're not bandits! We want to help the village, please listen! Remain inside, everyone! I'll go see what's happening. No bandits, huh? So, who are you? My name is Lynn. My colleagues and I are just traveling through here. We saw some bandits about. We're going to deal with them, but we need you to go and warn the villagers. Hey, wait! The name's Will. I'm a traveler of sorts too. Listen, these villagers have been kind to me. Mind if I fight with you? Not at all. We need all the help we can get. Welcome aboard, Will. By visiting the village, we gained a new companion! Will is an archer, he uses a boat to fight, boats can only be fired up for more than one space away. Obstacles won't affect your line of fire. Attacking enemies without moving next to them is called indirect combat. Yeah, basically, is that we can only, with the archer, we can only, uh, indirect, we can only use indirect combat. Not direct combat. If he, if he is in a direct Battle uh, will will not attack. He will only attack from uh, from uh, a distance. And Florina here is a Pegasus Knight. She can go great distances and fly, but she's very uh, frail. You know, she has a lance and she's very quick with it. And she becomes a fr great and strong character. But she is frail, very frail in the beginning. Knowing your unit's durability, learn everything. Yes. What do you do need to know, however, is that Farina has two weaknesses, actually, since she's a Pegasus Knight. First are her weapons choice. She has a lance, so she is amounty weak to the axis. But since she's a Pegasus Knight, she has a super uh, weakness against archers. And that's something that you will have to keep in mind here. Is that uh, if she fights an archer, well, basically you're screwed then. Let's attack with Sane and Kent here. Let's try to level, level them both up. Let's see how far we can get with this. There's something else that I want to need to explain, but I'm going to wait 
a little bit longer for you to explain, just to see how the battle turns out. See the archers here, they are also have archers. They will do double damage with Florina, which is going to be explained right now. Then what should I do? There's an archer! What? Where? Oh, that's well. Hey, you're one of Linda's, Lin's friends! Um. What? What is it? Are you and Will? I'm sorry, Will. Her name is Florina. She's timid around men, and you, you've got a bow. I, oh, I see! You must be a Pegasus Knight. I apologize for frightening you, but I do understand your fears of bows. Um, I am. Um, I'm sorry. Even a look at the bow frightens me sadly every much. Of course, I understand. But you really should only fear the enemy's archers, not your own. Yes, of course. You need to fly that because the knights are the world to vortex. Yeah, basically, uh, she is. She has double critical hit rate for uh, both, and she has a resistance against uh, magic attacks. So you have to keep that in mind. You came to the village to help, yeah, we'll... nothing's important is being said there. We do have uh, money still now. And I will move Florina right here. Uh, damn, the X will look and attack. But probably the, uh, the swordsman will attack first. So let's see, can we do double damage here? Yes we can! Let's see if we can uh, finish off the archer right here and there, and then we don't have to worry about that little problem. And let's move same here, so we don't have to worry about uh, the bandit attacking Kent, and him destroying Kent. Not that he will destroy Kent, but you basically know what I mean, right? Right. Let's end my turn here, and let's see who attacks who. Saint is being attacked by the bandit, and Saint kills the bandit. Nice. Now this one is going to attack Florina, which is to be expected. Uh, Florina is almost dead, but no worries. You don't have to worry about her, she will survive somehow. Even if she only holds on just long enough for you to uh, get some reinforcements here and there. Ooh, Will, you have a critical hit! That's nice. That's nice for you, but now you took all the glory for yourself. And uh, Sane will keep the glory for himself also. Because he will level up! Yes! Okay, ladies and gentlemen, the reason that I haven't been uploaded actually is because I have been working all week long and I don't see that I will have a free day uh, during the next week actually. So, uh, uploads will be slow, slower than usual. I'm sorry about that, but that's just how things go. And I will move Lorena here and move Lynn forward and move. Uh, Saint towards uh, Florina as well, and hopefully uh, Florina won't die from uh, the attacks, because I don't know if the uh, the swordsman will also be able to. No. So if I do this, Florina should be able to finish off the axe wielder right here, and she will gain some experience, which is nice. And hopefully Kent will uh, also be attacking this dude over here, so he can gain some experience. Now these buildings over here, these are the shops. Now if we go, go here with our knight here, we can go into the armory, armory, and you see here they buy an iron sword and an iron lance. What I want to buy right now is actually an iron lance. And uh, why that is uh, will become clear in actually right this episode right here. Let's move Lynn and uh, Will upwards, and let's end my turn. Uh, hopefully, can Will uh, level up here? Hopefully. If not, yes, he will. Okay. 
It doesn't really matter if he didn't up level up here. But I would have liked him to level up. Now what I'm going to do is move Florina up towards here. And as you can see, she has a slim lance. And uh, what that is, is actually a... It's actually better a weaker and more lighter version than the Iron Lance. Now what we have here is uh, in every weapon there is like iron and uh, let's see. She has a slim lance. Basically what that means is that this one is lighter but it's weaker so it can attack twice but it's always weaker than uh, uh, iron one. Iron one is heavier but it also basically does two damage of two times attack. After iron become becomes steel, that's much heavier, but also a lot stronger. After steel comes heavy, which is basically the most heaviest weapon in the game, but is also one of the strongest one. Uh, after heavy, we also have some other uh, weapons like brave and killer. Now those are special weapons. We will get into that when we can get those. And what this actually is, uh, the Manichetti, is a, is a sword with a perfect uh, ranking. Now the perfect ranking basically means it can only be used by the main lord. And can always be used by the main lord. Um, it's, there are three, per, uh, no, there are six perfect weapons in the game and can only be used by three characters, which are uh, Lin, Elwood and Hector, but each have two weapons of their own to, that they can use. So, basically that's the gist of it. We do have some other weapons, I believe, no, I think that's this. I think I covered all, all of the weapons. Draw your sword! We're not listening to any of your stinking apologies. We can let Will attack here a few turns, Not he won't level up though, too bad. I would have wanted le le uh, him to level up this turn. But I'm actually going to choose to level up Farina instead. But what I'm going to do is weaken him as far as I can with uh, Will over here. And I can attack him one more turn after this. And then after he's been weakened, I'm going to make a quick save state. And then after that, um, will I, I will attack with him with Farina. Which also will give off a special conversation with him. Oh wait, I forgot something. First of all, I want Sane to trade. Yeah, you can, if you go to up to an, uh, a charger, you can select trade, and you can basically trade the items, which I think we covered in the second episode, I think. Yeah, we did. Sorry for me, I'm being stupid. And then I'm going to attack him. I can also attack him with a Slim Lance. But then there's a, oh well, I'm going to attack him with a Slim Lance. Oh, excuse me. Huh? It's you. So, you changed your mind about coming with us, eh? Uh, no. But this is really is my fault. Really so can we? What? Come on. Let's out with it. I'm sorry. Can we? Can we just stop fighting now? You've got to be kidding. After I've been made to look like a fool? No way. <laughs> You're coming with us, I promise you that. Now, if you don't want to get hurt, give yourself up. And there, Florina attacks, and he attacks, and uh, Florina attacks again, and then he's dead. Uh, you'll live to regret this, my brothers. The Ganon Bandits. Or not let us die. And there she grew to level two. So that's finally taken care of. Lynn Florina, why did you follow me? It's so dangerous. Do you remember the night in ceremony? Of the Paris Knights of Ilia? Yes, you join a band of freelance soldiers to further your training. Is that what you brought, brought you here, Florina? Uh -huh. I wanted to talk to you before I set out. 
But when I went to Sakya, I heard that you were left with some strangers and... You were worried for me? Thank you, but I'm more worried about you. Me? Listen, more mercenaries are men, right? Bands of men. I can't imagine you being at all comfortable around them. I know, I know. It's just that I always dreamed of being a palace this night. I imagined I'd just work it out somehow. After today, I'm not sure. Maybe just give up. Florina, don't cry. Yes, there is no reason to give up your dream. Hmm? Huh? Lovely, Florina. I have the most brilliant idea. Same. You should come with us. With the addition of Will here, we're a fine group of soldiers. And freelance to boot. Wait, did you just include me? Of course, we were destined to meet her. It's fate. Come on now, Linda's band of mercenaries as good as a training group as you will ever find anywhere. Say, this is no joking matter. Linda's a... Lynn Mercenaries. I can give you details later. This is all a bit rushed. However, Sane is right. Will you come with us, Florina? Travel with you, Lynn? Truly? I would be so happy. Oh, so happy. So happy. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. Beauteous one, Florina. I am Knight of Lees of Salon. My name is Sane. Yeah! Stay back! Don't get so close! Ah, oh, beautiful and yet so modest! I beg your forgiveness, calling us mercenary. No, I approve we can't leave Florina on her own. She requires special attention though. Can I count on you? Yes, yes, you have what to ask. So, it is alright if I can travel with you. Yes, of course, well, if you're willing. Actually, I'm very grateful. Should be told, all my money was stolen and I'm uh, a bit of a crossroads. I would be honored to count myself a one of Linda's legions. Linda's legion. This is getting strange with everyday vision. And that is the end of the episode. If you have any questions about uh, the information that I told you, or anything else about voice acting or anything, th th f feel free to uh, contact me. If you have any questions, just ask me and I'll be there for you. Hope you enjoyed this episode and I will see you in the next one. <laughs> I always wanted to say that.